Also, if you guys didn't notice, I'm sick. Clearly, you can probably tell it in my voice doesn't match any of the other videos I've ever done, but I needed to get this video out, so here we are, and this is what we're doing. <laughs> and welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be a try on haul slash lookbook from Catch Me. Catch Me sponsored this video and decided to send me a bunch of clothes and I'm really excited to show you guys everything because I love everything. The quality is amazing, it fits well, and I hope you guys like it. If you guys like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss out on more videos like this one. I will link all of the clothes in the description box below, so feel free to look at it and decide which ones are your favorites, and if you want to get them, you'll be able to. The first item that I have is a two-piece set. These are the pants, and this is the top. So this is a really cute nude set. Fit was a little weird going on for like a second, but once you kind of like adjust everything, it looks good. Um, the shirt was bigger than I would have intended to have for myself so I decided to tie it up in a knot and kind of make it cute and make it my own but for every day and wearing like with sneakers or sandals or whatever even some boots during the winter super cute next up is this super cute romper in black and white it's got these little zipper details they actually open up all the way which is kind of weird because I don't really know what you do with that but regardless I would wear this with a belt or booties, boots, sneakers, you can really mix it up or dress it down. Super cute for the fall and winter. I've been looking for a jean dress forever and I have to tell you that this is the best one I've ever found. Bottom. The fit and the quality and the denim is stretchy so everything just like hugs right to your body. And for a tall girl like me, this is awesome because it's actually of appropriate length, so I can actually wear it. It's got little pockets. So cute. I'm actually really obsessed with this. I plan on wearing this all the time with white sneakers. I decided to get this next item because I had been looking for a white trench coat dress for the longest time, and I could never find one, and guess what? Plot twist, I still can't find one, but I feel like this was the next closest thing I could find to it. And it's basically a white romper, but it kind of has that like tuxedo trench coat looking style with a belt. I don't know, I fell in love when I saw it, and it looks amazing on. So this is definitely a good pickup if you want to get it, dress it up, dress it down. You got options, it's worth it. This next dress I saw, I think on Instagram, and I fell in love with it. And I knew that I had to have it. It's unlike anything that I own, so it's definitely a standout piece if you're willing to stand out. Uh, also excited with this one because, I, again, I'm 5'11", and it's not completely too short. I'll probably never wear this with heels regardless because it is on the shorter side, but. It, it's not too short to where like my whole butt is hanging out, so I'd probably rock this with sneakers or sandals, but it looks like this. It's a heart dress with these puffy little sleeves, so freaking cute. And then this is the back. It's got a little opening. And the little bows, I don't know, I think this is so cute. Definitely a me outfit. Gotta have it. And then, so I don't forget, because I'm probably going to, this, what I'm wearing, is actually one of the outfits. It's a dress. Can get a little. Love this, so cute. I actually just wore it to my sister in law's baby shower. It's definitely fun, flirty, a little summery, and I know we're getting into fall, but if you live in Florida like I do, you can pretty much wear whatever you want the entire year. So, it's not too late to get it. This next piece was another Instagram find. Before I get started and show you this, I have to tell you. It's a dress, but if you are probably taller than 5'8", it is not a dress. In the video, I'm wearing it as a dress so that you guys can see what it looks like and how it would look, but you can clearly see that I'm 5'11", and it is too short. 
For me personally, I'll be wearing shorts under this. Comes with a white slip to wear under. You can already tell this is a very small short dress. Again, I'll probably wear this with some white or black shorts tucked in. Then, this is the dress. Looks like this. I wore um, my Gucci belt in the video just because I didn't love their belt. Their belt's just a tie, like a tie around, you tie around the waist. You could put this in your hair, you could put this on as a bracelet, you could really do whatever. I just wanted to have a solid black belt go across versus just that piece of string. But this with some thigh high boots and matching headband, you cannot go wrong. Such a cute outfit. Look at all this. I can't. Adorable. But again, if you are not short, you need to wear shorts because it is not a dress. Normally I get like a bajillion tops for a clothing haul, but for whatever reason, this one I decided to get more dresses and more outfits than anything. So I did actually get one top, I managed to get one. It looks like this, it's a crop top in black with some sheer sleeves. I feel like this kind of sheer mesh is very in from looking at like the other items, like the polka dots one that I had, it's also a mesh. Like, I feel like this kind of thing is in right now. But anyways, it looks like this, it's got the details, and then the back actually has two ribbons. One closes on the top, and one closes around your waist. So, could you wear a bra with this? Yeah, probably, but it's got enough like padding and support to where you shouldn't have to. Um, if you're like me, I like to wear a bra with everything regardless, just because I just I like the extra support. So, will I probably end up rocking a bra with this? Yeah, there's a good chance that I just won't care if it shows. But, for most of us, you won't have to if you don't need it. It's good enough material and good enough padding and support to where you shouldn't have to. Then, last but not least, I got another two-piece set. It's a little, like, classy business. I love to get outfits like this and wear, like, a, um, like a lace bralette under. But... It looks like this, and obviously that goes together in the front, kind of like a blazer, but with no sleeves. And then these are the shorts, go under it, and it has a, a belt somewhere on here. You can get a better vab. I like it, super cute, wear it with heels, wear it with sneakers. You got options. I feel like all of these outfits pretty much you could go either way with, dress it up, dress it down. But I kind of gave you how I would probably wear it if I was going to wear it somewhere. Obviously, depending on what the actual situation or event is. But just so you get an idea. That's everything that I have for today's try on haul slash lookbook video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it and I hope you liked everything. Don't forget that all of the items will be in the description box and you'll just be able to click the link and get it hopefully if it's still in stock. I can't make any promises, but as of right now, it's looking good. Please feel free to let me know if you guys like this video, if you want to see more videos like this one, or if you prefer that I do my try on hauls the other way I do it. I know I kind of mixed in some of like my own accessories and kind of tried to put a vibe together um, just to kind of show people what they actually look like on versus just me putting the clothes on. So let me know if you guys like that style. And yeah. Don't forget to subscribe and give the video a thumbs up if you like it. I hope you do, and I will see you on the next one. Bye, guys.